Hey buddy, JD here and I am dragging my tired butt out of the mountains here where today I challenged myself for reasons, I don't know, just seemed like something fun to do, but I uh, challenged myself to see if I could fish four streams in four hours and catch at least one fish out of each one of those four creeks. It was really fun. And uh, how did I do? Take a look. It's kind of funny, it seems like every time I get a chance to go fishing, I'm confronted with, you know, less than ideal conditions, but whatever, that's fine. Wow. Speaking of less than ideal, look at that hair. I need a haircut, man. Anyway, now it's the day after Memorial Day weekend, and I'm expecting the fish to be a little bit shell-shocked. The masses have descended, fished hard the last three days, four days, because a lot of people get here on Fridays. And, uh, I don't know, they're probably in a little bit of shutdown mode. We shall see. Oh, 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 oh. Man, that's good. Hmm. Uh, I guess it's that way. It's brown. Back this drag off, this thing's got no room for air as I just saw. Ooh, that's a pretty fish. Yep, brown. Okay, buddy, we're just gonna unhook you here. <laughs> easy, easy. Get you down. Oh, now I almost go down. Whoa, <laughs> that mud is slippery. Okay, we're just gonna ease you onto the gravel. It's always a tough. Just gonna slide you down here, buddy. Easy onto the rocks. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. What a fish. Okay, how about in here? Slide you in just easy, easy, easy. Easy, easy. Come here, bud. We're gonna just. Get you in here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at this beauty. Over here. Turn right. Turn right. You wanna go right here, buddy. There you go. Okay, okay, yeah, you're all right. I'm coming the wrong way. There he's turning into the train. There we go. All right, off to creek number two. So creek number two is a tiny little trickle. I've never fished it. And in fact, I don't know if it even runs year round, so there may not be any trout in here, but we're gonna give it a shot. No. This is the uh, closest little thing I've found to a hole, and it has a little bit of open space, so put something in there. Okay. Jeez, there's trees everywhere. This is tough. Oh, oh, oh. I saw fish rise to it as soon as it hit the water. Okay. Try again. Oh, got him. All right. All right. What is he? What is he? Probably a brookie. Oh, yeah. Beautiful little brookie. Sweet. Okay. Come here, buddy. Get you in the sun. Where's the sun? Not much in there. some sun. Beautiful little fish. My goodness. Firebush should come right out. There we go. Awesome. Okay. Well, that didn't take long. Creek number two is going downstream that way, and it meets up with creek number three down there, but creek number three is over this ridge. As much as I like a good confluence hole, I'm gonna go over this ridge and see if I can cut down the time. Uh, creek number three is a little bit bigger. It's kind of the mid-sized one of the day so far. I'll show you here. I'm sure that little one had fish in it. This one does. So let's see if we can catch 
fish out of Creek 3. I'm not even sure that hit the water. <laughs> Can't tell. Try that again. Okay, that's in. Ooh, oh, oh, geez, that's a decent fish. First cast. That's a decent fish. Nice. What is it? What is it? First cast in the hole. <laughs> Love it. Love it. That looks like a... That's a brookie. Nice. Nice brookie, though. My hand's wet. God, look how pretty that thing is. Oh, my goodness. That's a nice little small creek brookie right there. Holy moly. I mean, come on now. That's so awesome. I have to coach my kids' baseball game tonight. I really should move on to creek number four, but I'm having too much fun. So I'm gonna mess around on creek number three here a little bit longer. Oh, oh, a lot of little guys. Little guys, oh, there's a big guy coming. I don't know if you can see that, let me adjust this. Try that again, it's tough to get him in this broad daylight. Oh, oh, he swam towards it. Somebody chasing it. Ah, I can't tell exactly where my jet. Oh, here he comes. Boom, got it. <laughs> that was awesome. Saw that happen. All right. Rookie. Okay, buddy. Okay, buddy. Man, they're so pretty. Okay, I'm just gonna try not to even touch you. Get you as low as I can. There you go. <laughs> Sight fishing. So cool. Okay, mission accomplished several times over here on creek number three down here, which is a really cool one. Um, it's one of those deals where you have to make a pretty precise little cast, a delicate presentation. And if you do, you get rewarded, which is awesome, so fun. Okay, it's now 10.36 a.m. Getting close to creek number four. And uh, yet another one I haven't fished. So we'll see, I don't know. This, this one's a pretty small one. Not that that stopped me so far today, but um, this one could be the most challenging, I'm guessing, because I don't, again, I don't know if this one, I kind of see it over there, I don't know that this one runs year-round either, so, I don't know. And this is one beautiful-looking creek. Again, I'm not sure that it flows year-round. It's got a really steep gradient with big cobble, which means spawning would be tough for little trout, but you never know. Nature finds a way, so... I'm gonna to try to find a little spot where there might be a hole. Maybe right up under that log right there. I can't tell how deep it is, but uh, everything else is real shallow and steep. So, I don't know, I might strike out on this one. We'll find out here. Boy, that, that presents a difficult cast. It's not very deep. Let me tell you, this water is freezing. Well, that was an awesomely beautiful little creek, but uh, I don't, eh, I don't know about this upper end. I'm going to see if I can't access it somewhere down a little lower, uh, maybe with a little less gradient and see if there's anything. Somewhere down here. And it's overgrown. So turn around and going back upstream I literally can't get on the water here so maybe get down there and this thing is just such a beautiful pristine riparian zone uh, if there's any fish in here they are well protected mm. 
All right there. The deepest, slowest spot I've found. And it's just totally guarded. I don't know how the heck I'd even get anything in there, but I'm gonna try. Maybe something like this. Almost like a jig thing. <laughs> Got a stick. Oh, 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 there he is. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Creek number four. Yeah. That was like punching for bass. Look at that cute little brookie. Oh my God. That, that was, that was crazy. That little hole comes this gorgeous little critter. Okay, buddy. Thanks for coming. Creek number four. Yes. That was so cool. That little spot, all these trees, I couldn't cast in there. I just dipped my tip, <laughs> jigged it a little bit vertically like I was in a boat. Boom. Got him. Creek number four, mission accomplished. And uh, I thought maybe this one was gonna get me. All right, <laughs> that was that was too fun. So I just checked my fitness app. And I'm feeling, I'm a little winded, sweating, it's hot out, 70 something degrees. And uh, my fitness app shows 5.2 miles. So in addition to some uh, fun uh, fishing, I got a little little uh, calorie burnage in too so that was that was sweet i will catch you on the next adventure if you uh would like to receive a notification when i post a new video hit that little bell thing wherever it is on the screen and uh consider subscribing that'd be awesome thanks